What is the linchpin effect? John Carter here. I'm the broker and owner at Remax for the city in Edmonton. Been a real estate entrepreneur for uh, over 20 years now. And this idea came to me out of uh, Darren Hardy's compound effect uh, that I listened to the audiobook for, for like the third time on a road trip uh, and then followed by Atomic Habits. So if you've never read, read either of those or listened to those in an audiobook format, phenomenal books as far as accomplishing your goals, figuring out the concept of uh, leverage and uh, exponential growth, like that incremental consistent behavior that leads to you accomplishing big things in your life. So we've all had them, big financial goals, health goals, relationship goals, but then something happens. You get sidetracked, life gets in the way, um, you know, you don't have the daily, weekly, monthly habits that are going to lead you to accomplish that goal. So the linchpin and the concept is think about that one activity. What's the one action that you can take that will lead to the other consequential action? So a linchpin, you know, if we all know it's you can think about it as a car tire, that kind of analogy. It's the thing that's there that's holding the rest of it together. That's what a linchpin is. So what's your what's your one thing that you do? that can lead you in the right direction, set you up for success to accomplish your goal. So for me, as an example, that's exercise. I know if I'm stressed with work, dealing, we have a, you know, a young baby at home, I want to spend time with my family. I also want to exercise and take care of my health. And I have uh, financial and business goals as well as social and, and fun stuff. It's easy for life to get uh, overwhelming, right? And so the concept is if I'm exercising and I commit to three days a week or five days a week, these consistent activities for exercise, for me, then I make different decisions about what I eat. And I make different decisions about probably what I don't drink at night, like have that extra beer or whatnot, right? And then I have the energy, I sleep better because I'm exercising, because I'm taking care of myself. And it's the psychological piece that for me, when I'm exercising, it's communicating to myself that I value myself, you know, I'm worthy, those kind of things is that I'm taking the time to take care of my health and, and manifest that in a way that's like prioritizing it. So then I make better other decisions as a result of that. It's kind of the small win strategy where if I'm doing that activity, I'm also going to keep myself more accountable in other areas of my life, shooting and striving towards accomplishing my goal. Hopefully that helps, gives you a little anchor, a little grounding that you can use uh, the linchpin effect to help uh, accomplish your goals. As always, share below, comment, uh, let us know what uh, your goals are or things that you've struggled with or what your linchpin is that uh, might help others as well accomplish their goals.